find the magnitude of two forces such that if they act at right angles, their resultant is root 10 Newton. But if they act at 60 degree, their resultant is root 13 N. Okay. So, we have the resultant in the equation R is equal to the root of P square plus Q square plus 2PQ. Cos theta is equal the resultant in the equation. So, at, uh, if uh, two forces act at right angles, theta is equal to 90 degree. And the resultant R will be equal to the now P square plus Q square plus 2PQ cos 90 now. Cos 90 in the value 0. And then the root of P square plus Q square root. Right. That is equal to the question letter root 10. Now, the square root of the square of the square root 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 of the square but if they act at 60 degree, that is theta is equal to 60 degree an angle. So, R is equal to the root of P square plus Q square plus 2PQ cos 16. Okay. That is equal to root of P square plus Q square plus 2PQ cos 16 value in the 1 by 2. That is equal to root of p square plus q square plus p q. In the value of the question, the root 13 is root 13. Now, the equation is under side of square. And the now p square plus q square plus p q equal to 13. Equation number 2. The equation is repeated. As all we did, the equation number 2. Minus equation number one cm. That is p square plus q square plus p q equal to 13 minus p square plus q square equal to 10. So minus is there value 3. But p square minus p square cut q square minus q square cut That is p q is equal to 3 in the Need the number equation would either. But then the second equation one P square plus Q square plus PQ equal to thirteen. And what I plus Q add here the Jerry. So what a corresponding plus Q in the value three add it on the Jerry. But then the now P square plus Q square plus two PQ. That is equal to sixteen now. Either end the side line P Q just add it to work. P square plus Q square plus 2 P Q more and then the P plus Q all square line that is equal to 16 with it. So then the root in another P plus Q is equal to 4 with it. And it's all we do then get in. Then then get the P is equal to 4 minus Q one with it. I will write the PQ to the PQ equal to 3 and the PQ to 3 and the PQ equal 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 to 3 and the PQ Plus 3 equal to 0. That plug it down. Q is equal to 1, 3. The values are in the end of the end of the P comma Q. And the values are the end of 1 and 3. And the just in substitute is okay. If Q is equal to 1, then P is equal to 4 minus 1 equal to 3. If Q is equal to 3, then P is equal to 1 and 3. The sum cup in the name of PQ, then the forces in the value in the one three on a link with me. Okay.